Hello everyone and welcome to MTV Cribs Nagoya Edition. Right where I'm going, that's where I work. It, it's not that long of a walk, it's pretty great. And then, turn this way, and we'll go right here. Well, I guess zoom in. Right where these cars are coming out of. Way back there. That's the grocery store, and the fruit store is just to the left of it. So, let me show you where I live. Gotta go down these stairs first. I was up on a little bridge so that you can get a better view. Okay. How close is this bridge to where I live? The answer is pretty darn close. So, there's a nice little place over here that usually does woodworking. What else? Hopefully I fixed the contrast issue, it looked a little bad there. Uh, there's, this place was like a New York style grill, but it's been closed down for a really long time. Apartment complex down over that way. Yeah, it's a pretty peaceful neighborhood, to say the least. And uh, right over here, a laundromat and a bunch of uh, vending machines, because this is Japan. And what would Japan be if it didn't have vending machines on every corner? Probably still Japan, just maybe people would be more upset they couldn't get their coffee as easily. So if you go all the way down here, you can look down here and see where I'm pointing where those trees are. That's the park. It's a pretty darn nice park, too. It's got a little, um, some kind of gravelly area with no grass. Uh, and that's for, I don't know, it's like in a shuffleboard of Japan kind of thing. It's really weird. It's like cricket mixed with shuffleboard. It's, it's so strange. I can't describe it any other way. Um, and then it's got a baseball field. And it's got a nice little fountain and some benches where you can eat. And sometimes I do go there to eat on my days off, like today. And you're looking at the lovely Leonex Suzu apartment complex. I probably should have showed you. Ooh, fancy poster board telling you what to do. Ooh, that says Leonex Suzu. Yes, Leonex Suzu, that's where I live. And if you were to press this little button right over here, ping pong, I would get to see you. And then I would let you in. So. Welcome to my crib. What's that? Now you know where I live. Welcome to my house. <laughs> I don't know the lyrics, but welcome to my house, MTV Cribs. Let's turn that off, actually. Yeah, we, we welcome them. We welcome them. It's okay, Flo Rida. Thank you, Flo Rida. So, let's start with where I put my garbage. Kind of a weird place to start, but let's start there. Um, there's a nice little vacuum. Got my suitcases that I brought with me. And it's very important to recycle in Japan. So here you can see a nice little recycling chart. They gave this to me to help me out. Um, so I got my plastic bottles. Usually I put like juice and milk cartons right here. Um, and then you got your burnables and your non-burnables, mostly plastics in this one. I also got something from a computer store that helped me connect to the internet uh, on my tablet. And it's a little USB to Ethernet port. And I got these for a dollar at uh, the Lawson 100, uh, which is like a little convenience store. Anyway, in here we have winter clothes. In here we have, uh, what did I put in here? Oh, sheets for the bed, sheets for the bed. And uh, in here we have computer parts for building my computer. Just the leftover stuff. Let's get some light in here. 
Light Switch 1. Light Switch 2 is already on. Light Switch 3. Well, that one was already on too. Light Switch 4. Light Switch 5. Oh, I know what you're thinking. What? What are you doing? Wait, what? Light Switch 6! <laughs> so much light. We have a lot of lights. Uh, and let me show you cooking area number one. Uh, rice cooker and oven and microwave. That counts as cooking, kind of. Um, yeah, it's you can't set the heat, but you can set a little timer. And it's got nice little helpful hints right here. Put a pizza in. Ha <laughs> ha, made a pizza. And then uh, rice cooker, that's self-explanatory. And then you got my little microwave oven. Boop. You turn the dial. Oh, I want 20 seconds, 40 seconds, 1 minute, 2 minutes, 3 minutes. Blah, 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 blah. So, is that 75? Oh, 15. 15 minutes, not 75. That would be ridiculous. Um, got some jelly. Got some manners. Got some mayonnaise. I didn't buy the mayonnaise. I don't like mayonnaise. But they gave me mayonnaise when I came here. Kind of a weird thing. But uh, there used to be a lot more in here. I ate most of it today. There was like eggs and milk and... Uh, all sorts of crazy stuff, but it's garbage day, so it's not even in the garbage room, because I already put it outside, and it got taken away. Um, honey, bread, cereal, got your peanut butter. It's peanut cream. They don't have peanut butter in Japan. Blech. Peanut cream's gross. Don't buy it. I'm gonna get peanut butter on Amazon. Gyoza sauce, because I like to get gyoza. Um, spaghetti and spaghetti sauce, and trash bags for the trash area. There's very steep staircase as you can see. I mean, one trip and I'm, uh, I'm easily severely injured. But I'll never trip. I got good footing. Here's my restroom. Not much to say. It's a restroom. It's got weird Japanese controls because every Japanese restroom has to be as strange as heck. Um, but I don't usually use those. I use this little knob. It's flush small and flush big. That's all I gotta know. Here's my only complaint about this place. There's not really a lot of cooking space. So usually I have to grab this little desk and move it in here so that I have some room to work with. Um, yeah, see, that's about all I get. About the size of my hand. The sink's in use and the stove's in use, which they usually are if you're cooking. So here's a little drying area, drying rack. Here's my happy sponge. Hi, sponge. Hi. And then uh, here's uh, pan, and, you know, some other stuff for cooking, and with some more happy sponges, they're happy, they're happy together, let's show them how happy you are, yeah, they like being here, and then, um, washing machine, where's the dryer, I'll show you in a bit, uh, deodorant, hairspray, razors, soap, stuff to put in the washing detergent, there we go, Advil in case I get a headache and stuff to clean the bathroom. Oh, and floss. Floss is important. Boom. Let's see the bathroom. Or, I guess this is the shower. No, I guess that's technically the bathroom. The other one's the restroom, I guess? I got a bathroom and a restroom. Two separate rooms. Uh, hello. There's... I mean, that's what I meant to say. Hello. Uh, there's... Shampoo. Conditioner. Various soaps. Hairspray, just a razor, and toothbrush and toothpaste. There's, uh, like most Japanese showers, as soon as I close this, I can spray water everywhere! And it's not going to cause any issues because they're built that way. Except for up in here. I'm pretty sure if I spray water in here, I'm in trouble. But I, I, I'm not sure and I don't want to test that and find out. So that's all we get to know about that one. And then you have to dehumidify everything in Japan. Uh, so I hit this button. It starts a dehumidifying process in here. Um, if you don't dehumidify, you can pretty much guarantee yourself that in about six hours, there's gonna be mold growing everywhere that water was. So let's hit these lights, because we like to save electricity. It's good for everyone. Oh, I forgot to mention, I got a huge thing of rice for like 20 bucks at the grocery store. I'm pretty sure I won't even finish that in a year. Hello, Florida. Welcome to my house. This is my living area. I built this computer yesterday and it works like new. Thought it would cost about 400 bucks. Lucky me, it only ended up costing about 250 because I went to a discount parts store. 
and everything works like a charm. You can see the monitors on. Uh, so that's pretty grand. Uh, I got a little sentimental Laveau scarf, and when it gets cold, I'll probably be wearing that um, from my vacation to Magiscala. Fun stuff, fun stuff. Some more sentimental stuff. Here you can see my Incon. Boom! I stamped it with my name. Uh, and then, you know, controller for playing games, tissues, because you'd be surprised how bad allergies are here. My eyes get all poofy pretty much every day and I gotta blow my nose, but it's not too bad. Um, here's a living in Japan helpful thing. This over here is what I take to work. It's got all my important stuff in it. Um, some supplies, some papers from Eon to make my job easier, and I like to keep track of my receipts. So they're in here. The big receipts for like electric, housing, water, all that stuff are right here. I'm gonna get a separate folder for them. And the TV. Um, hmm. Well, I couldn't understand what was going on on the TV, so I don't really watch it. So it's unplugged right now. Uh, it's saving me some electricity and whatnot. And then this is junk mail in the corner that I just either gotta throw away or sift through and see what's useful. Sometimes we get some really good coupons in places like this. So I don't wanna just throw it all out yet. And here's where you dry stuff. In Japan, you dry stuff on a little drying rack. But I go to the laundromat because this thing doesn't work very well. I'm gonna be real with you. Um, so, oh yeah, and here's the backpack that I bought. Uh, I pretty much take it with me everywhere I go. Uh, work, going shopping, whatnot. And here's the best view of the whole place. I'll even take the screen off. So, let's scoot the screen over so you can see. Look at the pretty trees in the nice neighborhood. Oh, there's nothing cool that way. Nothing cool that way, but look, it looks so nice from here, right? And that's it. I hope you uh, learned a little bit about how I live. It's really nice here, it's super cozy. Maybe if I could, meh, I don't think I'll be able to. I wanted to place the camera so you could see how big the floor is in comparison, but that's not really a good size, huh? Can't really, can't size it up based on that, can you? Anyway, it's really nice. So, thanks for watching my video. I'll post more soon. Bye.